the Infusionsoft order forms aren't mobile responsive. And what I mean by that is they're static pages that don't recognize the width of the customer screen. And so if a customer comes in with a mobile device that looks something a little more like this, then they're still going to have to scroll left and right to put in all their details or zoom out really far, which makes the whole buying process a little tedious. And so if you use Infusionsoft to sell digital products, then the video I'm about to show you here will be perfect. Uh, I've got some code for you to implement right into Infusionsoft, and it should help with your customer's experience with the Infusionsoft order forms. So let me walk you through it here. Um, the first step is you'll want to uh, go ahead and jump into your Infusionsoft account and click on e-commerce setup. And there is this section called Order Form Themes. Click on that and click Create a New Theme. And uh, unfortunately, the, what I've done with uh, this particular responsive theme only works with the basic gray. Um, there will be more coming soon, but uh, right now it's just basic gray. So click on Use This Theme. I've already got a bunch, so I'm not going to add one more to my list. Once you've clicked on it, um, it should open you to a screen. It looks something like this where you can swap out the Custom Tees logo. I've gone ahead and put in my own logo. And then there are a few basic things you'll want to do. Scroll down a little bit on this page and you should find a couple of files that you can download. And they're just text files with uh, some code in them. So if you click on Edit CSS, You'll see there's an apparent, apparent CSS box and a layout CSS box, and there will be corresponding files. So if you click on uh, appearance.css, the file that I've got, go ahead and just take the whole thing, copy it, and then just delete everything in here so it's blank, and paste what I've um, got in that file, that apparent CSS file. Do the exact same thing with Layout CSS, delete everything, open up Layout CSS, copy the whole thing, and just paste it right in there. And then save both of those boxes. Now there will be a third file, which is just basic info, and it looks something like this. I've already got it in here. Um, when you open it, it'll look like this. Again, take the whole thing, copy it, and then just paste it right into this custom header box under the HTML areas tab and then save that. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and jump back into e-commerce setup and uh, click into order forms and open up the order form I'm working with. My particular order form here is called Tasty Nachos. Uh, I've got a recipe for $44 and it is a digital product. Now right now this is only going to work with digital products. Um, Physical products are also coming soon as well. And uh, from there, go to your theme tab and then uh, choose whichever theme you had created. Uh, I don't know what you called yours, but uh, once you have chosen it, you can just click on Make Active and that'll overwrite everything right in here. <clears throat> and then it should bring over you know that funny code in the HTML custom header area. Uh, and everything should work as intended. So go ahead and click on Preview now. And what you'll see here is I've got my Tasty Nacho recipe. Everything is looking as it should. What you'll notice now when I, um, when I scale this down as if I were on a mobile device, you can, you can kind of see that it is dynamic and it changes the shape of the images and the size of these boxes. And it's much easier now for somebody with a mobile device to come and purchase my products. They don't have to scroll left and right uh, to be able to input all of their information because it's all right here in one spot. And uh, it makes it you know that much easier. So I'm going to go back into here and uh, click on links. And there you go. There's your new link. Uh, and all you have to do is uh, update that link on your website wherever it goes and you've got a mobile responsive Infusionsoft order form. 
Uh, one final uh, legal disclaimer, I guess, here is that Infusionsoft is always changing their code, always making updates. At any time, unfortunately, this can break if you know they change their structure. And what I'm hoping for is out of the box, Infusionsoft gives us some options where we can just have uh, mobile-friendly order forms natively. But until then, this should get you where you need to go. And of course, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and uh, I will get to you as soon as I can. Thank you.